are going to continue with the the, the combustion chamber and the head. Uh, okay, uh, we are going to start checking this uh, uh, diagram that I prepared. This is schematic about a, a diesel engine. Uh, I don't know if it's clear. Uh, this is the block. Uh, this is the piston. Uh, this is the crankshaft. This is the gear of the crankshaft. Uh, this is the camshaft and the gear of the camshaft. Uh, this is the fuel injection pump and this is the gear of the fuel injection pump. And uh, how is the communication? Why you need to uh, uh, integrate all of them together? When the crankshaft is working together with the camshaft. Why? Because uh, in some moments when the piston is finishing the compression, I need that the camshaft start to open this valve or this and at in the moment of exhaust I need that the camshaft open the exhaust valve and close the intake <clears throat> in the moment of the suction I need that the camshaft open the intake valve and close the exhaust valve in other words the valves are opening and closing in different moments depending of the position of the piston and if the piston is traveling up or down no in other words the camshaft and the crankshaft, they need work together. They need be synchronized. This is why you need to put your engine on time. Uh, this is why uh, you need to frequently verify the tune-up of the engine. What is the meaning of tune-up? It's, it's, it's synchronization. Yeah, you, you hear that, uh, ah, I have black smoke, I need to calibrate my engine, I need to tune-up my engine. You remember when you replace in gasoline engine the spark plugs, the cables, yeah, and you organize the timing. The timing should be perfect, perfect. This engine, this this picture is related with with a diesel engine with mechanical fuel injection. Those gears, those three elements, they work together, working at the same time. Imagine this, guys. Imagine that uh, I am finishing in this engine, finishing the compression, the compression, the compression, the compression, and I am two or three degrees before the top, the center, with the piston going up during the compression. What happened in that specific moment? The piston is going up. The piston is going up during the compression. What happened with both valves? Both valves should be closed. Close. Uh, okay, the piston is going up. And just before the piston reached the top, the center, what happened? The injector spray, because this gear is connected with this and this. And the injector atomized a little amount of fuel. And what happened? Kaboom, and the piston goes down. Explosion. Now you understand why this, this, and this should be synchronized? What happened if the piston reached and the injector never opened? No explosion. Ah, what happened if when the piston is going down in the middle, the injector opened? This is not the moment. Right now the pressure and temperature is not proper. And what happened with that fuel? That fuel goes out through the exhaust pipe. And once again, in the other cycle, it's off, it's off, it's off. You understand, guys? The timing is the most important part. The timing, especially in diesel, should be exactly in the point. 